Hi everyone and welcome to Upload VP. My name is Andrew Watts and in this WordPress tutorial we're gonna learn about this. In uh, this uh, WooCommerce tutorial part 4 we will learn how you can add products to your shop. To do this go to dashboard and under products we can add products categories tags shipping classes attributes so first we want to create categories so this will be uh, facial beauty category then copy this then uh, paste it in here this is a uh, URL friendly text go down to display type you can choose products you can also add an image so we will have uh, this facial image click on use image click on add new product category then we can add another one so body beauty copy the text and add to slug choose products choose a thumbnail click on use image add new product category okay so now we have body beauty and facial beauty then we can go to add product first add your title then we're gonna add your description go down and add a short product description so this is a preview of the product in the gallery go up choose the category you can add a product tag Click on add. Choose a product image. Click on set product image. You can also add the products to gallery. Click on add to gallery can add more click on add to gallery then go up up here we can choose product data if you want to have a simple product this is with no attributes we can enter general information you can add SKU this is the identification number for the article so we can add this to 1001 set a price to 45 you can also add a sales price to 40 you can make this shadow let's say you want to have this starting at Monday and end on Friday Okay, so this sales price will start at Monday and end on Friday. Then go to inventory, choose manage stock. If you check this you can add how many products you have in stock. We have 15. 
if you want to allow back orders do not allow allow but notify a customer allow so we will choose do not allow in stock out of stock if you want to enable this to only allow one of these items to be bought in a single order we will not check this then go to shipping add weight to the product choose the dimensions if you want to have shipping classes you have to go to save drafts then you can go to shipping classes so shipping classes can be used to group products of similar type these groups can then be used by certain shipping methods to provide different rates to different products. If you want to use this, just put a name, use a URL friendly version and add new shipping class. We will not use this, so we will go back to our product. Then we want to go to linked products choose if you want to have upsells this is when they view a product you can add another product cross sales you can show products when they viewing their cart you can choose grouping set this option to make this product part of a grouped product go to attributes so this is if you want to have different colors or different sizes. Let's say we want to have different flavors on our body butter. We want to have mango and strawberry. Then you click on add. Type in the name, flavor, choose the flavor. So we want to have mango and separate with uh, alt 7 choose another flavor we want to have strawberry click on save attributes go and change the product data to variable product go to attributes unbox this one and check this one used for variations click on save attributes go to variations click on add variation choose a flavor mango Then click on add variation then we will choose strawberry then we have to go to set this click on the arrow choose the price sales price if you have that click on manage stock special stock quantity for this strawberry product 15 allow back orders do not allow in stock the weight is already set shipping class same as parent click on save changes do the same thing with the uh, mango then we can go to advanced here you can uh, add a note that the buyer will get after they bought an item from you. Here you can uh, custom ordering position. You can enable reviews. Okay, so this is all we have to do right now. Then we go to publish. Go to the website. Go to shop. 
then we can go to select options okay so here we have the product we have the image we have the product gallery if you click here we can go and have a look at the pictures close this we have the title the price the short description here we have the attributes flavor if you click on mango we have 18 in stock if you go to strawberry we have 15 in stock the category body beauty tag body butter we have the full product description also the additional information this is the weight and the size we have no reviews yet okay so this is how you set up your products in your WooCommerce store up next we're going to add widgets in sidebar and in footer we will also change the color of the add to cart button okay everyone i hope this helped please uh, subscribe leave a comment make a thumbs up you can also go to our premium support forum at uploadvp.com and uh, we will see you in the next tutorial so have a great day and uh, goodbye